10 Tips for Taking Better Care of Your Orchids If you are new to the world of orchids, don't be afraid of them. Many orchids can be easy to grow if you take some time to learn what they need. They are not like traditional potted plants. They are epiphytes which means that they do not grow in dirt, but rather by hanging on to the bark of trees. There are some orchids, most notably lady slippers, that are semi-terrestrial and grow in the loamy soil of the jungle floor. So let's discover together the most important 10 rules for taking better care of your orchids. 1. Prefer clay pots over plastic ones. Although more expensive, the former have more porosity and better drain water. If you choose plastics, keep an eye on watering so as not to soak the plant. 2. If the base of the orchid is less than a finger from the mouth of the vase, it must be replaced. Try to leave it two fingers high below the mouth of the vase. 3. To accommodate it in the new vase, notice which side the new shoots come from this as the front of the orchid. The back should be pressed against one side of the vessel to steady the development of the specimen. 4. For pot change, add coconut fiber or moss chips to the plant. The latter needs to be washed with water to remove excess sand. 5. Before cutting the orchid, sterilize the scissors. Let it cool for later use. Important. Repeat the operation before handling another orchid to avoid disease transmission. 6. When discarding a leaf, pass ground cinnamon at the cut site. The ingredient is a natural healer. 7. Foliage stains can be softened with rope smoke. Boil the smoke in water for one hour until it becomes a concentrated solution, which should be diluted with water. Spray the leaves over and over until it works. 8. Scale and aphids can be removed from the leaves with coconut soap. Use a brush to scrub the leaves. 9. Note the foliage color. If it is dark, relocate the orchid. The more contact with light, the more it will bloom. 10. Install plastic nameplates on your orchids. In addition to the species name, note the period of its last flowering. The next flowering can be stimulated with NPK103020, which has more phosphorus concentration.